Natasha Ryan, and I'm from Brooklyn, New York. And I'm here talking to you, well, all of you, to en encourage you and to give you my perspective on what it's like to compete in this certain To be really honest, I, I avoided it in the beginning because I was really shy and it forced me to be honest. I'm big on honesty. I think flamenco is big on honesty as well. And doing the work required to even get on stage, it brought me to another place, not only in my dancing, but I feel like in my humanity. I, I would say, you know, if you love it and it means a lot to you, then do it. It's easy to be put on the fence by other people, and I think that that's something that's happened with me. Someone told you you couldn't, someone said you weren't good enough, and then you internalize those things. You felt like you weren't good enough. You felt like you couldn't do it. You felt like, oh, who am I? Those are, those are questions that, at one point, if, it, if flamenco really means something to you, you have to put them aside because you don't have time to waste. It's your life, and this is a really good place to start. There is no end point. You don't get on the stage at Lincoln Center and have it be over. It's just, it's one step on a long journey. It goes for a lifetime. All of the things that you weren't expecting to come out of the process, maybe you were expecting A, B, and C to happen, there's going to be X, Y, Z, you know, coming from out of nowhere. Find space to love and to express that love. Day. Whatever it is that I can do to bring my best forward, what I'm going to do, and that's how I empower myself. Having that experience and, and working with these people and getting their advice, it let me know that I was on the right path. You know, like I said before, if you love it, you have to do it. And there's a point where the fear of being vulnerable to the audience is less than the, than the desire to move forward. So I would just say, if you love it, then not doing it, where does that leave you? Does it leave you with regret? Does it leave you with unanswered questions? If you try, then you cannot have any regrets.